Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Handmade by Gardena and I am doing hashtag 52 tags handmade and this is a challenge by textile artist Ann Brooks and I'm behind so I went ahead and skipped ahead so I went ahead and did week number 19 which is words and this is the tag that I made and I sort of did what Ann did and up front I have like um I have this little flower here that flips up and then it is on this fabric here which is like a newspaper lock and I have the word dreams here which is um, I got it on Etsy and it is on saved by grace is the name of the Etsy shop and this is her journaling prom prompts but this isn't my word I just added that on there to be decorative and then you flip this up and this is my word it's create and I hope that you can tell what it reads. But it's, it reads create. And then you flip it up again. And it says smiles. So create smiles. And I sewed a button here. And then just did three little French knots there. So it's just something simple that I did today to try to catch up for week 19 and I got this uh, base fabric here and this fabric here as from Happy Mail from Christina from Christina Creates so thank you Christina I'm already using your fabric so there is week 19 I did get week 17 done and it was couching so I did something simple on that today too I took the red and white ticking and the blue and white ticking and I got it on well I may have bought I bought some of it at Joann's and then I've bought some at Walmart and I've bought some on Etsy so I'm not really for sure where I got it and then the white fabric I got at, from Rachel at her Etsy shop at Roxy Creations and I sort of and I did all six strands of the red and blue of the oh the uh, embroidery floss so it would stand out and I sort of wanted it to represent the American flag. So that's what this sort of represents. It's simple, but that is what I, what it, what I want it to represent is the American flag. So this is week 17 couching and week 19, which is words. So all I have left to do is week 18. So... I, my bigger ring did come in, but I don't even think it is going to be big enough for us. So we will probably have to use a couple of rings when we get done with this time of the year is out. Maybe even three rings because, I mean... Look at this already. It is. This is the biggest ring that I could find on Amazon. Which they had some uh, like loose wire rings. But I wanted the solid ones. Because I just felt like that they would be sturdier. But we are getting a lot of tags on there. And I really like the way that they're all coming about. Uh, I did get both tags sewed today. 
So I am definitely getting faster at sewing. I still have to stop and take a lot of breaks because my hands do hurt. They don't lay down quite flat though. Maybe if I fold them out like that they will because I do have a lot of um, thickness in a lot of the tags which I don't mind that if we have to use a couple of rings then that will be fine with me. So that is what our tags looks like so far. I'm just missing one week and that's week 18. And week 18 was, hold on and I will tell you what week 18 was. Week 18 is, um, Paper piecing. So, um, what she done is she made hexes with um, paper pieces. So, when I get that tag done, I will show it also. So, um, thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate it. Welcome to all my new subscribers. I appreciate you. I hope you enjoy my channel. And uh, thank you for coming to subscribe to my channel. And thank you to all my current subscribers. Thank you for putting up with me. I appreciate you all so very much. I enjoy doing my YouTube channel very much. You all bring a lot of happiness to me. And I just, I don't know what. I would do without you all because this last week not doing a video I was like I gotta get a video made I'm s I have got to get a video made my husband's like you can't do a video and I'm like but I really want to so I missed not doing a video for you all this past week so yeah I really I really missed you all but anyway um Remember to do your 15 minutes of happiness a day and uh, encourage others around you to smile. Spread that happiness to others around you and try to stay healthy. Try to stay safe. Um, most people are getting their COVID shots. I mean, I know there's some side effects, but we each have to... Excuse me. We each have to do our part. I know I had side effects from my shot, but it's okay. At least now I've been vaccinated, so maybe that will make me a little bit healthier and make everyone around me healthier and safer. So, yeah. Go and get your vaccine if you've not done that. If you, if you want to get your vaccine, I mean, I'm not telling you you need to. I mean, it's your choice. I'm not one of those people that are going to preach about why you need to. I think it's a person's choice if they want to or not. Same thing with the flu shot. It's your choice or not because it's your body. But just continue to stay safe, stay healthy, do your 15 minutes of happiness. I do think you need to do that because um, if you don't do your happiness, that can cause some mental problems. And if you're having mental problems with depression, anxiety, and all that, that can cause you to have some physical problems also. So, yeah, you need to keep your mental health as healthy 
as your physical health. So, just thank you all for everything you've done. I really appreciate it. If you don't mind, uh, give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate it very much. And if you've not subscribed to my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you would. Just hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell for when I put up a video. I'd really appreciate that. I always forget to say that part. I don't know why. I just always do. I say it every now and then. Not much. But you all have a good day. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.